Yo, what is going on guys? In this video, I'm going to be showing you an insane solo AFK money on RP method that can generate you millions of dollars as well as a lot of levels in GTA 5 Online after the patch of 1.68. But quickly, before we get into that, if you do want to enter our 27,000 subscriber shop card giveaway, then all you gotta do is drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and then comment the word giveaway and you'll be entered into that. But yeah, anyway, let's just get straight into the video. Alright, so first things first, to get started with this, you're gonna wanna go to the description of this video, and down there you're gonna see three different links. One is gonna be for Xbox, one for PlayStation, and then also one for PC. So click whichever console you are on, and then you can go ahead and bookmark the job once you've signed into Rockstar Games account. And once you've done that, you just need to restart your game, and now we just open up your pause menu, go to online, jobs, play job, go to bookmarked, and then come down to the survivals, and it is gonna be right here. So on Xbox, it is gonna be called AFK Solo Survival Number 2, so you can go ahead and start this up. Now if you're on PlayStation or PC, the job name is going to be a bit different. But yeah, just go ahead and start up the job. If you guys don't want to have to spend hours grinding out these glitches, then make sure to check out the Instant Delivery modded accounts from MitchCactus.com. They provide money up to $1 billion, as well as RP levels over 100 for Xbox, PlayStation and PC. They also offer account boosts so that your existing account can have money and RP added to them. On top of that, they offer cool modded outfits and even insane modded cars with F1 and Benny's wheels and a lot more. These guys have over 9,400 reviews on their official Trustpilot page, so they are the best and most highly reliable modders by far. Their link will be in the pinned comment and description, and make sure to use code EVADE for 5% off of your entire order. Now once you're on the settings, you can go ahead and change the time of day and the weather if you like. You can also turn off the radio as well. And now for the starting weapon, you can choose anything you want. However, if you do actually have an up and atomizer or a stun gun, I recommend you choose that like I do right here. You can also purchase all of the ammo, then just confirm the settings and start up the job. And now as you can see, we're going to spawn inside the job. So on Xbox, we're going to spawn inside of the pier right here. And there's going to be a bunch of these med kits and also these armors over here. And now basically, I'm just going to let this play out so I can show you actually how it works. And then I'm going to show you how you can actually go AFK. As you can see, once the first wave does actually go ahead and start, all of the NPCs are going to spawn as you can see on the minimap, however we can't actually see them. And basically what's going to happen is they're going to be taken out automatically, and it's going to complete the wave completely for us. So as you can see, once the wave completes, it's literally going to start up the next one just like that. And now each wave we get completed, it's going to give us some RP and some extra money, which we're all going to get in one go at the end. So now in order to actually go AFK, what you need to do is grab an up and atomizer or a stun gun. And you can literally just hold your trigger, so your right trigger button, to keep on shooting the gun. And it's going to keep on doing it automatically. So for this, I recommend using a rubber band. I'll show a picture on the screen right now how you can set this up. So you can just put, put a rubber band right here and set, the, set it to the right trigger to hold it down. Now another way for you guys can actually go AFK is going to be using the analog method. You can basically just run around in circles, so put both your analog sticks together, facing each other. And it's basically just going to run you in circles just like this. Now I'm not really a big fan of this method, as sometimes you can actually get kicked doing this. So I, if you do actually have an up and out or a stun gun, I recommend you use that instead. But yeah, that's how you can go AFK, now you basically just want to sit out the whole 20 waves. It should take around 15 to 20 minutes to complete. So I'll see you guys once this is fully finished. Right, so as you can see, we are in the last wave, number 20. So I'm going to let this play out, and I'm going to show you actually how much money and RP we get at the end. So keep in mind, this did only take around 15 minutes to complete. So once it does actually go ahead and fully finish, as you can see, we got a total of $36,000, as well as 2,200 RP as well. And considering that was only 15 minutes, that is pretty good. And once it goes to this screen right here, you can go ahead and hit replay, and just restart the job again, and do this over and over again for however long you're going to be AFK for. And yeah, you can make a bunch of money and RP doing this each day in GTA Online. But I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, do be sure to drop a like and subscribe. But anyway, I'll see you guys in the next one.